Somehow, dogs fill in the void in your heart that makes you feel disconnected from the whole world. However, we all know that dogs don't instantly enter our lives complying with our commands or knowing what specific gestures mean. Loving any dog breed that you prefer won't come that way either. At the end of the day, they still need to be familiarized and trained. With this, as their best friends, we can either have them trained through dog training done online or in-person dog training. Remember that good behavior comes from practice, training, and dedication. Dog training is a vast world, and lucky you because you can start training your dog whenever you want to. Watch through this video to know more about what's best for your fur baby. First, let's discuss what dog training really means. Dog training is a way to minimize your dog's destructive behaviors and maximize their good ones. Well, for sure, we adore our fur babies so much, and as their fur parents, we always want what would keep them safe and happy while living with you. Especially when both of you are around other people or even exploring the outside world. The best way to keep them that way is to keep them trained. Dog training can help correct if your dog suddenly and randomly barks at anything or anyone that would go near you or your house. If you want your dog to respond to your call, commands, and gestures or even to play with them harmlessly, dog training makes these things possible. The dog training world started to grow so much because a lot of dog owners prefer for their dogs to be trained. At the same time, average dog owners don't have enough time to learn how to train their dogs. For these owners, no need to worry because as the dog training world grows, trainers are also countless nowadays. So are you convinced enough to get your fur baby his personal trainer? To help you start off, here are two types of dog training that you can choose from. The tradition tried and true in-person dog training, and on the other hand, because of the limitations that the pandemic has brought and the distancing that is now required, an online dog training has been entering the scene these days. Which one is the best and more effective for your fur baby? Which one should you choose? What are the advantages and disadvantages of each? The in-person dog training. In-person dog training is what it is. The training will consist of the dog being trained by a professional who teaches your fur baby by example. The trainers would play, have fun, bond with your dogs throughout the session. The use of physical cues and other techniques will also be used to condition them to show the desired behavior that is expected from them. There are two types of in-person training. Watch through to know what's best and fit for your fur baby and be guided by their pros and cons. 1. Training alone. Training alone is done with an exclusive trainer who only focuses on your dog. Compared to other types, your trainer has his full attention towards your dog and his behavior. With this type of training, the exclusive trainer can mold your dog's behavior quickly and effectively. A. Training alone. Pros. As we have mentioned earlier, being in training alone in-person dog training has the trainer's full attention to your dog. This way, the trainer can easily interpret the behavior cues of your dog and react to them immediately and effectively. The trainer can also deal with complex issues concerning your dog as your dog has the trainer all alone. This way, your dog can adapt to what is being taught quickly and efficiently. B. Training alone. Cons. In-person training alone can result in having a higher risk of exposure to illness. This type of training is also not flexible in terms of time, location, or even money, given that this training is more expensive than group classes or online dog training. Your dog may also lack socialization skills as your dog is not exposed to or able to befriend his other fellows. If you are interested in other dog training videos, check out some of our playlists and discover even more information about dogs. 2. Training in classes with other dogs. This type of training consists of a group of dogs being taught by a trainer. With this training, your dog can socialize, have fun, and learn with other fellows. If one dog ends up behaving well, the domino effect will apply. The other dogs will learn from him and follow through. A. Training with other dogs. Pros. The biggest advantage to this type of in-person dog training is socialization. 
Your dog may get to socialize and have fun with his other fellows. Your dog will also learn how to adapt and work around distractions eventually will be more effective in following your commands in all situations. Financially, this type of training is less expensive than personal or alone training. B. Training with other dogs. Cons. Again, considering the pandemic that we are in, there is an even higher risk of exposing not just your dog but also you to various illnesses. At the same time, group training might be more distracting for your dog and might make him uncomfortable and unable to focus. Given that it's group training, tensions between other fellows may not help your dog as well. You're probably thinking about the YouTube videos on YouTube, but hear us out. Having online training and watching those videos are two stories. Online dog training is having virtual training from the safety of your homes. There are also two types of online dog training. 1. Virtual live training. During online training sessions, the trainer will be meeting with you and your dog through online meetings and use time slots to train not just your dog but also help you learn how to train your dogs as well. A. Virtual live training. Pros. Training your dog at home means that your dog will be training in a familiar environment. At the same time, you can start your dog training right away. Having online training is also flexible in location, money, and scheduling as it seems that you hold your own time. Financially, this is less expensive as well. Most importantly, you won't be risking exposure to dangerous illnesses considering today's situation. B. Virtual live training. Cons. This type of training won't easily deal with the more complex issues that your dog has. It would be harder for the trainer to see and react immediately to the behavior of your fur baby as well. Having virtual live training means that you also have to secure a stable internet connection. No socialization will be experienced by your fur baby as well. At the same time, your dog may not listen to you. 2. Pre-recorded sessions. This type of online dog training is not live. The company will simply give you videos and recommended schedules as to when to do the training. Should there be any other concerns, the owner can contact the company immediately. A. Pre-recorded sessions. Pros. Training your dog at home means that your dog will be training in a familiar environment as well, making it easier for our dog to learn. This is also flexible in timing as you can begin whenever you want and continue when you are available. You won't be risking you and your dog to illnesses or diseases as well. B. Pre-recorded sessions. Cons. The very vital disadvantage during this type of training is that your dog's trainer will be unable to observe and immediately react to your fur baby's behavior. No socialization will be experienced by your dog, and that it may be more difficult for him to learn. All four types of training have their own advantages and disadvantages. It is up to you to determine what would be best and fit for your fur baby. Nonetheless, take training as a way to build connection with your fur baby and cherish your paw friendship happily. Thanks for watching the video. Do you want to be a good pack leader and stop your dog's behavioral problems for good? Check out the first link in the description and get your dog training video series absolutely free. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more dog-related content. See you next time.